What's up guys, here is Claudio from Visual Modo WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to change the H of the Revolution Slider Premium WordPress plugin easily. So as you can see here, we are on our Spark WordPress Team demonstrative contents and we already have imported the Revolution Slider uh, slideshow made on to the theme demo contents following the video tutorial that I'm gonna leave the link in the description below and a card over here. But you don't like this full widget and full H slider layout and you want to change it. You want to change the H to make it a little bit shorter or small. How to do that? First of all, go to our WordPress dashboard, scroll down until you find the Revolution slider button, click on it and click on to the slider. As soon as you load the slider, we're gonna click on slider settings. So, first of all, we're gonna have the content source, it's the default slider. We have the slider shortcode, in the case that you want to change the shortcode name. And right here, we have the select the slider type. By default, if you imported the theme demo contents slider show, it's gonna be the hero slider. What is a hero slider? It's a slider without navigation and made to be full widget, with full attention full look into only the slider and as you can see right here we have the full screen option in the slider layout we're gonna need to change it for the full widget as soon as you change it we're gonna be able to play with the slider size let's have a look into the slider right now it's already changed Now let's scroll down just a little bit and we're gonna find the options for grid sizes. As you can see, you can choose the slider size for both desktop, laptop, tablets or phone devices or you can set the custom grid size as off so it can be automatically following the desktop mode. And like here, I'm gonna be changing the layout grid size for the desktop Let's refresh the page. It's full widget because the slider will follow the, the size choose for the widget and for the H. As you can see right here. This is the proportion, one housing, one thousand. 240 and 500, 500. Let's change it to the standard slider. Just you can not see. We're gonna have more extra types in the case that you want. But once this is a single slider, we're not gonna see any difference. And as you notice, as the as the proportion, this slider gonna be full H in the case that you use 800. While using Revolution Slider plugin, you may need to disable the cache. I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here for a video tutorial where I explain how to disable cache so you can simply update the slider and see the result immediately. Once this plugin uses cache to load faster, but cache is not very good. Now let's align the test into the slider. We're gonna move to the slider editor right now. We're gonna select all the content and just with the keyboard type to up so we can move the text and align it, the slider contents. Now, let me show you how to disable the slider overlay so the menu can be separated by the slider. 
and I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here for a video that I talk only about it. But it's here on your page options, settings, overlay, navigation, no. Let's refresh. And as you can see, the menu is no longer transparent and it's separated from the slider. Now, let's just make the slider a little bit smaller in H. And it's done. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check the visualmodel.com portfolio of amazing WordPress teams with all those features and much more. I see you later. All the best!